of this. Or not. Okay. That's fine, too. I still don't get how this works. Okay. Oh, big guy, move it. You lost a true uh, believer already. Don't think I'm that close to the end of the level. That. Uh, Build something here. Okay. But not technically connected to that. Not these pieces I do, but maybe they did. Yeah, okay, they did. Really. Yeah, something tells me the raptors uh, sh should be, would be attacking the, uh, yeah, uh, we need those uh, minions, but they're not for some reason. Yeah, I know I can walk across. I think we can cut the middle of the shield. Equip the shield. Uh, Boy, I could use a superhero right now. Is dead? How come you're not melting? Help. Hey, I'm gonna help you, Stan. Boy, I could use a superhero right now. Help! Boy, I could use a superhero right now. Boy, I could use a superhero right now. That's one of the purple stuff that's up there. Boy, I could use a superhero right now. Fine, I'll leave it. Shut up, Stan. I really have to ride it. Break the wall. I gotta just set it off. So, okay, that's cool. This is a purple one. I don't know, they first introduced the purple studs in uh, Lego Star Wars 2 in the challenge areas and the, the gold the gold brick the gold brick doors where they do the challenge things. So they introduced the the uh, gold studs and then, I mean, purple studs and then they later brought them into the regular levels. I mean, there are there are many per level, but they're still there. I ain't really built for swimming, Cap. The water's too fast, even for me. Look for a way across. Yep. Hey, we can get across from here, but he can't. So we're gonna have to open the door. There. Right there. Okay, another turret. Come on, Ben.
You know, turrets are broken. So as my uh, channel name implies, I'm a retro gamer. So it's funny as up any old stuff. I know I mentioned it in at least one of the oh, the 3D World commentary. I don't know if the original old consoles I got. I got one used game store in my uh, city, which is Regina, Saskatchewan. So I get from there. But then I also got this local uh, expo uh, called Fan Expo in Regina. I also bought some games from there from a couple of vendors uh, that's once a year. Uh, that's not a, bad, not a bad little expo to have. I always get some celebrities. Sometimes they want, sometimes they want a bit too much money for an autograph and uh, pictures, but. You know, like William Shatner, for instance. I like 80 some each for a picture and an autograph, so I said script. Only because I didn't really watch much of his. Before I started watching Star Trek a year ago, or whatever it was, I actually only had ever seen him in uh, the failed TV show, Shit My Dad Says. So, and I did, of course, watch Star Trek, but. Still wasn't exactly worth it enough to me to pay the money. I could pay that kind of money. Ooh, okay, you can go up this. I just want to throw this at that. Uh, there you go. Yeah, so we had some celebrities. I got a picture with uh, Shannon Doherty. My well, these two things I know from being Charm and the original Beverly Hills No. 210, which I've never seen that, but it's in Charm. And we had actually the first year I went, uh, I can't think of her name, but the woman that played uh, Lois Lane in the original Superman movies was actually there. Kind of wish I already had a picture with her, but oh well. Oh, I have my shoe in there. And the one year, second year, the there's the twins that played the Weasley twins are there. Actually, again, with the first year I went to, actually had uh, the guy that played uh, uh, number two, number one. Uh, what's his name? William uh, William Riker. Yeah, that's his name. Uh, I can't think of what the actor's name is, but is it Will Riker. I don't know. What the... I don't know his name. I think it's Riker. The last name anyway. It could be dead or wrong. I was trouble remembering. And actually, uh, ah, the last two, I think, the year before, the year before that, uh, last year, that uh, guy that played Data was actually there. And, and interesting. Here's to see who uh, shows up this year. This some sort of Hydra trick? Like I know. Just hang on. A lot of rafters. <laughs> I was gonna say, where's Chris Pratt when you need him? But Captain America, <laughs> Thing. Charles Xavier sends his regards. Storm. Hey, the weather god is saying such a bad trade up, especially for John. <laughs> hey, come Jeez. back, you Brady cat! Quick, we must find a way to follow Magneto. Yes. Capture and put him in a plastic prison. I throw Mystique in there too, so she can't, uh... Well, never mind. You have to find somebody to 
get Mystic's powers if you can't turn to someone else. I'm gonna put it in there. No way, Spiel. Let me find a way out. Let's save. Two of the third volumes of comics uh, last year. Uh, Ms. Marvel comics, uh, volume one and volume two. Can't really know a good place I have to buy uh, used comics in my local city. Well, it's the only place because the uh, one used comics that we did have shut down. It wasn't even that good anyway in terms of selection of used comics, which I mean, yeah. So. I used to have another one years ago, used to have another one years ago before I got into comics, but it's gone too. So we don't have these comics store anymore. Next closest one is about an hour away in uh, Moose Jaw. Uh, what do I need here? Her? I'm not sure. Now, now you can technically go higher than that. I see you in the, go in the sky. Fine, don't fly. storm power up yes yeah, so I mentioned before and I think I mentioned it in a 3d world in 3d world uh, post commentary but I do plan to get back to doing more of the uh, finish up the, the Atari games uh, videos them and then I got those two Atari flashback classics collections for the uh, PS4. I want to finish those up. Plus, also record some Kaliga Vision and television, at least the games I got. The view. We need to find a way past those guns. Stuff. I prefer other classic games. I think most classic games I'd do, I'd probably do with an emulator. Unless I find... I'd rather do it with the actual carts, but in mean, certain games I could say like... Uh, Magical, uh, Magical Quest Star Making... Uh, Magical Quest series... The Disney Magical Quest series, or the Castle of a... Castle of, or the illusion, uh, the illusions, the Disney illusion. See, I don't want the Castle of Illusion. That's just the first game, the illusion of a series, I guess. The Disney series, the Disney ones, the Mickey ones, on and the uh, Genesis. Those too, because like, they'll where you save it all, and there's a password. So those of them would easily do it, regardless. If I had a better way to do it, but what's or not, just so I could use save states to, you know. Save that I'll start at the beginning. At least I have to quit for something or something else. Which is a good game, I just don't want to have to start back. I just want to have to start back at the beginning every time. You know, I've always wondered why. Like after a. Like even though there's better backup became a thing during the NES era, why there, is, why there were still games after that. On the NES, SNES, and Super Nintendo, that use, that use uh, 
either had no saving ability, saving the password at all, or your passwords created the ability to make actual, you know, save files with the battery backup. Why not use that, or at least have passwords? I guess at least, I mean, I guess at least with the with the passwords, you would never really lose the progress, which is saves the saving. See if I was cut up the battery back up there. If the battery dies. I see you've enjoyed playing with but my pets. Let's see if you enjoy playing with this one. That's the biggest deal. Bring it. Rhino. Why'd you come after me? Isn't that a Spider-Man villain? I just want to be left alone. <laughs> you went to Magneto, not you. Not us. No, oh, why does that disappear? I wasn't me that broke the wall. This is stupid. You can die. It's not falling when you need him. Well, he's no health bar yet, so. Yeah, let's build something to stop the rhino. Boulder? <laughs> oh, pumpkin. 